It's that time we all, we all fear. And we also all love, because of the cuteness. Toddler time. We must be at our strongest and stay the course. These toddlers can smell fear. <laughs> Hello, I'm Kelsey. I'm single, and so we thought it would be funny if I tried the 100 baby challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have one matriarch, and they are supposed to have 100 children, all with different parents. There's a lot of rules to this challenge. If you're interested in those rules, the link will be below. Last time we hit 29 children. It's really starting to like snowball, I think. We're really getting our feet under ourselves and just like chucking those kids out, you know? That's um, Chelsea having babies. <laughs> Visual is crazy. We're back at the baby factory here. Chelsea's just given birth. Uh, she's feeling great. We got Bran. He's taking a nighttime swim and what? <laughs> the Grim Reaper uh, gnome has some creepy glowing eyes, which is great. It's almost John's birthday. Yeah, well, we're a little behind on these aging. No! Bad child. No. Discipline. Strict. No. Firm. Do not make a mess. No. You interrupted Chelsea's dinner for this. She is mad. Look at her. She's like walking out. No! What are you doing? Are you gonna eat while you- Oh no! Someone fell asleep. Who fell asleep? Oh my god! Our little bean! She is- Level three's on everything! Okay, so you just do whatever you need, girl. You just do whatever you need. And uh, little John is also upset, but he is done, so you're good to go. You can go potty. I think you need to go potty a little bit, don't you? Nova, I don't know what Nova's up to. Like, honestly, Nova, you need to not be upstairs right now. Where's Chelsea? Chelsea's taking care of business with the babies. So Chelsea, since you're like kind of okay, why don't you use the toilet and then why don't you cook some uh, cook some meals for the kiddos here. We've got a new thing. It's not just about garden salads anymore. Although, you know, we'll never fully give up our garden salads. And it's also that time to put two new birth certificates on the wall. Look at that, just weird and amazing. Good job, mom. Why are you still wearing that? That's my question. <laughs> She's taking care of babies. Baby serious. Someday you'll be an animagus and be accused of murder. Aww. Cute. Uh, okay. We got, a we got a lot of plates. Discarded plate time. We love a discarded plate. Yes, you're doing that. You're getting ready to be potty trained by your mom. Chelsea, what you, what you sitting for? She had to sit to ask her child if, if it wanted to be potty trained. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so messy in here. Yikes, big yike. Why don't you like clean up some of this stuff here? I just need this clean. I just bought a no! What are you doing? I'm just cleaning up this mess. Absolutely not. Absolutely drop everything, Chelsea, and tell your child what is up. That is not cool. Oh my gosh, Freya! Poor Chelsea. She's like so tired. She just had a child. Now she's got to clean up all these messes but I'm like, I want it clean. It's bothering me. I don't like it dirty. What? Don't, no, 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 don't do that. Why would you sleep in the hot tub when you have a perfectly lovely bed that you won't drown in? Okay, he is doing great. Why don't we have Bran age John up? That'll be kind of cute and weird. Go on, help John blow out those candles. Oh, there's a baby crying. Chelsea, there's a baby crying. Go, go fix that. Oh! I can't wait to see what John looks like. I say that every time a kid ages up. I can't wait to see, but it's true. <laughs> John aged up. Okay, pick a number one through four. The answer is four. Four, so he's a social butterfly, our little John. Pick a number one through 30. The answer is two. Two, so John is a genius. This is a little bit of a surprise. <gasps> oh, he's really cute. Look at cute little John. Aria is uh, asleep, so we'll, we'll wake up Aria and then help Aria blow out her candles. You up, Aria? She's sad, but soon you can take care of your own needs, independent woman. Pick a number one through four. The answer is one. One, creative. Okay, pick a number one through 30. It's 26. 26. Oh, a loner. Aria is an artistic prodigy and a loner. That feels good. Good job, Aria. Oh, look at Aria. She's got short hair, just like in the show. Good job, Aria. Okay. 
Sirius is upset. Chelsea, you gotta wake up. Oh shoot, okay, change that dirty diaper. Breastfeed and bounce. Go on, Chelsea. Brand's embarrassed, I don't know why. <laughs> why don't you cook up some, some, I guess mac and cheese. The, the family never has a mac and cheese moment. I don't know if they've ever had mac and cheese. What if they're all lactose intolerant? I don't know. Look at Aria, she's so cute. John's homework's done. Good job, John. What a good boy he is. And Aria is is very good, so she'll just uh, do her homework. It's Sunday, so we have like a full day for them to get their act together. Aww, Freya, so cute. Wait, why are you not in bed? Read Freya to sleep. Freya, what are you doing? You know what, just go to sleep. You're bothering me now. Okay, only two Tods. We can handle two Tods. Chelsea maybe doesn't look like she can handle two Tods. Okay, yeah, Sirius needs some attention. Why don't you bottle feed Sirius a little bit and bounce him? We gotta show Sirius some extra love because in the books he did not get that as a child. There's like a little kid crying in her bed and Chelsea's just sleeping through it. <laughs> You're okay, John. Just go back to bed. Go to bed, in a new bed. This looks like a beautiful day to have like a pool time. I'm very envious. The reflections of the water, our, you know, dead cow plant in the background with our little gravestone that we totally forgot about with Gavin, who once was a ghost, and then we released his spirit to the netherworld because we didn't want him to be a ghost. Uh, memories, right? Oh, Bran acquired the fitness skill? What's he up to? Uh, walking. All right. Oh no, John is seeing, like, monsters. Is that on brand or what? <laughs> John sees monsters, no one believes him. Oh, he was unsuccessful in his attempt to communicate the monster under his bed. Looks like he doesn't want, it doesn't want to be friends right now. Wow, John, that feels about right. <laughs> John's eating alone, matching the yellow chairs. Very uncomfortable because he was scared of a monster. Who can blame him? His watch has just begun. Chelsea needs some fun. Chelsea, why don't you, why don't you do your little workout dance? <laughs> It's just so funny to me. Workout dance, Chelsea, workout dance. <laughs> it's little things that make me giggle in The Sims. <laughs> Ow. Is he gonna just watch his mom do it? He changed the channel like a jerk. Mom's still trying to do the dance. Rude. She was like just almost uh, at the next level of fitness. All right. Chelsea, you gotta go take care of your baby. I mean, I know he's your baby too. Freya's super hungry. Oh shoot, Nova and Freya are soups hungry. Oh, and need baths, great. Okay, well, the toddlers need help. <laughs> Stacy's right here. Stacy's mom, she's got it going on. She's she's all we ever wanted. We've been waiting for so long. It's almost Sirius's birthday and Stacy's birthday. Okay, well, we get her, better get these uh, toddlers on the move. <laughs> Once you're done with that, oh, you're just hungry again? You're hungry again? Why do they keep needing food? Arya's just chilling there, sitting alone at the table, just <laughs> happy as a clam. John, oh, John really needs to pee. Why are you still doing that, John? I told John to do one task and he never finished it. He just continued to do the task until told to do something else. Arya's a little more independent. She's like, I'm gonna do what I want. John's getting some, I think it's uh, mac and cheese. That's a big, amount of mac and cheese, it's huge. Looks pretty good, honestly. Where are you going? You picking it up and moving? Uh, okay, John. Oh, he's waiting for Aria to give him a hug. That was so cute. He made a friend and he's happy. Uh, everybody's school starts in about an hour. Good, 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 good. Everyone's doing fine. Aria's off to school. Bran is off to school and John's off to school. Study hard, my babies. And speaking of babies, these two are upset. Chelsea, who's calling you? Lunch of sadness, some other kid threatened John and took his lunch money. <laughs> Poor John. Find the kid or I will, you, you tell him. Chelsea's a very protective mom. You know, she's like, you find that child. Chelsea, oh, you know what Chelsea, maybe you should uh, get a new freelancer job. What is the most expensive thing you got? 3,300, 4,000! <gasps> really important guy here. I need someone to write about me, like a biography. I've done some cool stuff in my life and people really, really need to know about it. My accomplishments are many and numerous, so like, come and write about me. I mean, dude, 
you're paying four thousand dollars chelsea do it let's chat with that client that seems like very into himself she's like hmm this guy seems like a piece of work name the book 12 years in knave life in the court of queen of hearts it sounds adorable i'm gonna keep that nova's very hungry oh no nova Okay, good. I'm glad you're already fixing this problem. That's the impeachish may way. Independence. Miles is wondering if I want to go over to his house. Not right now, Miles, but you can come over here. Why don't we invite over some of our some of our kids? Let's get some of the people we haven't seen in a while. So Miles, Alexis, and maybe like Renee. Yeah. We haven't seen any of them three in a while. Why doesn't she invite them all over? They can help celebrate uh Brand's birthday. Why does one of my children look so sad? Renee! What? What happened? Why are you so sad? Well, uh, Alexis is sad too. Try to cheer her up. She seems pretty blue. And uh, where is where is our, our other girl here? She go upstairs? Oh, is she in our closet crying? Uh, okay, so it looks like Aria is fine. Bran is an A student and John is just fine. No, uh, great. Okay, no, you're not, you're enraged. Oh man, he is a mess. Well, why don't you just cook yourself a nice, I feel like he'd make himself like a fun cake. Let's make a winter cake and then he can invite over his dad. Oh my goodness, he's like pretty miserable. Aw, but she's having a great time with her kiddos. Oh, Nova's decided to run around naked. That's fine, you know, work on your movement skill. There you go. And then uh, why don't you call over? Oh my wow. goodness, you are just a mess here, aren't you? Let's have you take like a fun, can you take a cold shower? Just chill out a little bit. Ugh, he looks so annoyed. What a drama king. Oh, whoa, he just like walked through that door. You know, he's an alien, he can do what he wants. Meanwhile, I feel like Chelsea should uh, ask her latest fling over. Veer, can he not come over? Oh my gosh. Well, we'll just work on that right now then. Oh my goodness. Why don't you watch some channel surf a little bit while your dad's coming over? There he is. Chew out. No, don't chew out your dad. Have a deep conversation with him. Oh no, all the kids are leaving. I wanted you to stick around for Bran's birthday. That's okay. Why don't you blow out some candles, Bran? <laughs> he looks real mad. I don't think him and his dad are that close. Blow out those candles. Happy birthday, Bran. <laughs> He's aged up. Pick a number one through 42. It's 32. 32, okay, so 32. Cat lover. Aw, Bran's a cat lover. You know what, and I'm not gonna make you move out just yet because uh, Chelsea needs to keep chatting this guy up. Are they not good enough friends yet? Oh my gosh, she only has seven days till she ages up. Oh my gosh. Hurry up, Veer. What, I'm sleeping. Ah, shoot. Dang it. Ah, nerds. Oh my gosh. Chelsea, I'm gonna have you travel alone to someone's house. We gotta get this done. We can't waste time, Chelsea. You need to seduce someone now. Jace Thomas. Oh, flirty introduction, great, fantastic. It seems like they haven't met before. What's up, Jace? I feel like she's seduced a Jace before, but clearly not this Jace. So we're good. Brighten his day, yep, do another. Oh no, he's not feeling the flirting right away. That's fine, let's, uh, let's talk about cooking. You know, joke about fashion. Let's also like ask to go in their home because she really needs to pee and I don't want her to pee in front of him. All right, we're on a mission here. Can we go in? Yes, okay. Ooh, and also it's his uh, Damien. Let's get a flirty introduction to Damien too after she uses the restroom. Actually, maybe not in front of his, the roommate that we're currently trying. Let's just do cheerful, you know? Let's focus on one at the time. I wonder if she could just like, Sit and chat there. Oh, he's romantic. Oh, no, 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 Chelsea. Chelsea, 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 Chelsea. Okay, you know what? Go sleep in their bed. It's weird, but like, just go ahead. Oh, he didn't like that. I'm sorry. She's tired, Jace. Ask about his day. I think that one's a very nice one. Flatter him again. His twin brother's going to bed. Um, no, don't ask for a small loan. You don't need a small loan. Talk about monkeys. Monkeys, so funny, right? We need to get this done. I cannot stress enough that Chelsea is aging by the day and she stops aging when she's pregnant. So we need this. Okay, she's gonna kiss his hands. Let's see if he's into it. Oh, he seemed into it. Okay, discuss interest. Let's get some more flirty things going on. Our girl is quite tired. I couldn't care less. She's gotta get this done. He seems to be picking up what she's putting down at this point. Yep, let's get an embrace. I really like flirting and embracing. First kiss, let's go. Let's go, this is working. This is working. Is this working? I really thought she would have passed out by now, honestly. 
Oh my god, I think his brother's like getting up like, why? He just he woke up to catch their first kiss. Can she woohoo with him yet? Okay, she can. Oh wait, we need to get him out of the house. Okay, we're saving and going to manage worlds. We can't woohoo and have a baby until he's out of the house. I totally forgot. So we need to get Bran out of the house so she can do this. Okay, we're gonna edit this family. Edit. Yep, Bran's gonna move in with uh, Willow and uh, Ginny. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Back at it. We're doing great. She can, oh my gosh, is this gonna happen? I'm so happy. Chelsea's never done this before. She's getting quite bold, but honestly, I don't blame her. You know, the time is ticking. She's got a goal. Oh, he's got cute pants. They match. How cute. Oh, wow. They're having the baby though. I've never been prouder. Zero to a hundred. Oh, she's gonna pass out. Well, and this is how it ends. Well, they had, they woohooed, so we'll find out very shortly if uh, she's uh, pregnant just as soon as she gets up. All right, she's up. She's gonna go to the bathroom and see if she's pregnant. She's not pregnant. All right, once more. She just woke him up in his own house and was like, hey, I'm not pregnant. Can we do this again? He said yes. Oh my gosh, our kids are starting school in an hour. Like, <laughs> doesn't matter. Here we go. Round two. <laughs> She's sleeping a little bit. I'm gonna let her sleep in a little bit before she takes that pregnancy test. Okay, John's off to school, so is Aria. Study hard, my babies. She's not pregnant? Uh, are you serious? Are you serious right now, Sims? All right, round three. <laughs> Best of three, Jace. She's now getting really hungry too. I don't blame her. Three rounds in one evening is quite a lot for a human, but she is a trooper if nothing else. Oh my God, is he a detective? Wait, Damon got real hot just now. <laughs> Next, as soon as she like, you know, makes this, makes this happen. Okay, come on, Chelsea, come on. Woo, eating for two, boom. We did it, go home. You don't need to even tell him, just go home. You're so tired. I guess she'll tell him the good news. He's never even gonna come over to the baby factory. Their entire relationship occurred in these four walls. Baby 30, it's coming soon. Okay, so Chelsea is literally miserable because we pretty much killed her. Uh, so why don't you go to sleep? Okay, bye kid, they're going to school. Shouldn't you already be at school? Ooh, Chelsea's wearing her summer outfit. I love this, oh. Goodbye, sweetie, goodbye. Thank you so much for being just a good kid. You know, he helped cook and clean and, and uh, you know, he's just a really quality helper around the house, Bran. You know, much more useful than the Bran of Game of Thrones. <laughs> I said it. He's done a lot of sitting around this season. Anyway, <laughs> Chelsea! Yeah, go to sleep. Yes, she deserves it. Oh my goodness, so bad. Ah, grades are up. Arya and John. Oh wait, is John not a B student? Is it just Arya? John's a C student because he didn't do his homework. No. And Sirius is upset. Didn't we just take care of you? Poor Chelsea is just freaking dead. Oh gosh. No, 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 no. Super efficient baby care for Sirius before you take a shower. You take care of your baby first. There you go. That's that's a good mother right there. Aw, John and Arya are doing uh, homework together in the room. So cute. Yes. Chelsea, eat up that food. Oh, that was not very much at all. Is there nothing left in here? No, okay. Well, she's gonna have to cook a, oh, a gourmet meal. Oh my goodness. Pasta Primavera, how fun. Let's do that. Oh my gosh, we are getting fancy here on Hunter Baby Challenge because we've got money. Oh my God, Craig from Dream Daddy is calling about Jace from the grave. <laughs> Drama. Aria, yes, swim playfully. Yay, good girl. Yeah, get that skill level up, yeah. Get that skill, yes, get the skill up. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Keep going. Yeah, now you can use the restroom. You really need to go. Oh, Sirius is awake and complaining again. Oh man, Chelsea's so sad and tired. Sirius is a very needy baby. He's seriously needy. Oh wait, what? Stacy and Sirius just aged up. Oh, Sirius aged up. All right, pick a number one through eight. It's five. Five, so uh, independent. Sirius is independent. Good job, pick a number one through eight. The answer is six. Six, so, and uh, Stacy's fussy. Well, that that tracks. Oh my God, look at these new, new Todds. They've got matching haircuts. Boy and girl, so cute. Oh, you're hungry. Well, I can't take you downstairs, but I can take the food upstairs. 
There you go. Why don't you uh, grab a serving? Are you hungry too? Yeah, why don't you both grab a serving while mom is downstairs working on giving a bath before she can come up and drop you downstairs. What do you need after this, Freya? You need fun and food? Same. Okay, now you're really hungry, so let's get you some pasta primavera. Fancy Chelsea is getting fancy. The transferring of toddlers downstairs is quite always a funny moment here. Uh, and then, we gotta get Stacy as well. Pick up Stacy and transfer Stacy downstairs as well. Aria's pretty good, so why don't you swim around again? It's Wednesday morning, so you need to get that skill level up. What are you doing? <gasps> You're gonna clean the toilet? Yeah, clean the toilet, Aria. Clean the kitty toilet. Oh my gosh, what a good kid. I like can't even handle it. Can you clean up that one too? Okay, she's going to school now, and so is John. Meanwhile, all of our toddlers but Freya are sleeping. Oh, Chelsea, don't have an accident! No, 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 no! Chelsea, you're right by a bathroom. Just go use it. Go use the bathroom. Go use the bathroom. Go, 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 Chelsea. Oh my gosh, how did we avoid that fate? Magic. Magic is how we avoided that fate. Chelsea, why don't you cook a new, like a little caprese salad. Ooh, it's like a garden salad, but fancier. Chelsea's getting fancy. She's becoming a fancy gal. Aria's a B student still, and John's now a B student, so that's very good. Chelsea looks sick. It looks like Chelsea got some, um, some kind of illness that she probably needs to take care of. Oh, you're happy? I've never had a child wake up happy. This is shocking. Oh, come on. Come on, Nova. You're almost there. Did you not do it? Yeah, you did it. Yes. So Nova only needs imagination and potty. Oh, Chelsea is not feeling hot. Okay, why don't we have her get some medicine on the computer? Oh yeah, you need to keep writing your book. Wait, continue book. And then meanwhile, I'm gonna buy medicine. There you go. She's gonna be better in no time. I kind of like this look. She looks like, looks like some cool birthmarks. Like she's like a tigress. Oh, is it going away? Oh, I don't know if she needs it anymore. Looks like it went away. So there you go. If you just ignore sickness long enough, sometimes it goes away. That's a life lesson for us all. Take your illness seriously. <laughs> Never mind. That was a bad joke. All right, all the all the toddlers are getting food now. It's toddler food time. Sirius, weirdly, the only kind of happy child. He's having a happy childhood. I'm so happy for him. Why did Nova go all the way over here? But then the other three are eating together. I guess there wasn't a third, a fourth spot over here. Kind of makes me sad. John just discovers something under his bed. John, you know, just don't worry about that. You know, the supernatural is always going to be stalking you, bro. Chelsea finished her book. Good job, Chelsea. I'm so proud of you, sweetie. And why don't you send to that client for approval? What? This work doesn't meet our quality standards. It needs to be edited before you submit it again. What the heck? Are you serious? I guess she needs to go to bed. Okay. I hope you don't miss it. It's due by Thursday. Oh, it's Wednesday. So she's kind of running the clock down on that one. Aw, he's hanging with his sister. Why don't you uh, talk about toys and stuff? Yeah, now he's level four. Boom, double tasking. Chelsea's not in a good mood and can't really provide any help right now, but I think she just needs to do it. She needs to give bath to the crying baby. I think it's Stacy that needs it. I'm sorry, Chelsea. You gotta be, you gotta be in mom mode. How is Sirius? Sirius is also sad because he needs a bath. Deadline for Chelsea's is coming up. Ah, frack, okay. All right, Chelsea, you gotta finish that. You gotta edit it. Oh no, someone passed out. Who passed out? It was Arya. Arya, I told you to go to bed. And I understand there is a monster under your bed and it is very scary, but you need to get over it. Seriously, you can't do it? Oh God, do you not go to the bathroom? Oh, she's gonna go throw up. Amazing, and then pass out. You know, freelance work is probably not for our girl. Let's just put that out there. Oh God, I guess she needs to sleep. Oh, the children are sleeping in her bed, so she's gonna go sleep in the kids' room because the kids are afraid of a monster under the bed. Whew, the Peter Shmaya family is a little bit uh, struggling today. Go Chelsea, go, 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 go. I don't care if you're hungry. I don't care. This thing is due in 15 minutes. Are you serious? Are you seriously not doing this right now? Please, wow. They agree to end the contract with a pro, oh my gosh. Well, Chelsea didn't uh, didn't get her, the gig done, but honestly, that's not the end of the world. I really don't care. That's so annoying that they didn't like our, you know what, we're gonna just sell it to a publisher. It's probably fine. Chelsea's like almost fine, which is good. We're out of food here. I think Chelsea ate the last bit of it. So Chelsea's gotta cook 
cook another gourmet meal? Nah, she'll just cook a garden salad. It's, you know, when push comes to shove, she's a garden salad gal at heart. She's looking so preggers, but it's so cute. Her little cute bump in the, in the crop top and the jean shorts. I don't know how you'd find maternity jean shorts like that, but I'm sure there are some out there maybe. Okay, all the kids are hungry. So Chelsea, you gotta finish that garden salad fast. You're angry? No, 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 don't do that. There's gonna be food like really fast. All the all the toddlers are gonna wake up and descend upon the food at once because they're all very hungry. Garden salad time. Come on kids, everybody wake up for a garden salad. Yes, you get a garden salad and you get a garden salad and you get a garden it's almost Freya's birthday and Nova's birthday. We're working on it, <laughs> okay? All of the toddlers are like walking around enjoying their, their meals together while Chelsea sleeps. I don't know in what household this could ever happen, but I'm happy about it. All right, you're gonna go work on that potty skill, my friend. Are you ready? Are you ready to be a kid? Cause I'm ready for you to be a kid. Maybe he'll grow some hair as a kid and then you can clean up your own mess. Go Chelsea, go Chelsea, go. Go Chelsea, go Chelsea, go. Wanna go pee? Have you gotten it yet? No, you're so close. Go potty again. Potty level three, potty master. Good job. Freya, wait, why? Why is this all happening to me? Freya, go potty again. Yes, okay. And you are totally fine. I don't know why you're crying. So many potty kids. She's like, all you gotta do to potty is just let go. <laughs> I'm gonna be a terrible potty trainer. Just let go. Just release into the toilet. No, you were so... Close. Oh, don't ask for potty help. You don't need, oh, Ginny and Willow, are they on the property right now? I don't care that you're sleepy. I really don't care. I'm a bad parent. Yo, Freya reached level three of potty. No, we don't want to go anywhere, Natalie. We want to stay right here and age up these two Todds. Wee! let's get that cake that brand made. This is the cake that brand made, yeah. Okay, happy birthday. Oh, uh, looks like Aria is enjoying a nice garden salad moment while Nova gets aged up. Okay, I can't wait for Nova. <gasps> no aged up. Pick a number one through four. The answer is three. So Nova is a motor kid. Pick a number one through 33. The answer is six. Six, so uh, creative. Nova's creative and a bit of rambunctious scamp. Add some birthday candles and then Chelsea, why don't you help blow out candles for Freya? Oh my gosh, look at Nova. She's very cute. Very cute young lady who can shower herself. Happy birthday, Freya. I think Freya's gonna be our crazy gal. Well, uh, wild chat. I don't think we've had, had a wild kid before. Okay, pick a number one through four. The answer is one. Creative. Pick a number one through 33. It's 24. 24, so 24, a glutton. All right, Freya's gonna be a glutton. A little wild child right there. Great, Freya and Nova are aged up, which is great. Aria needs a lot of TLC here. We, we need her to sleep. We need her to use the restroom, to use the shower. She's got a lot to get done. Chelsea's quite uncomfortable, understandably so. I believe she's in her third trimester, so she's gonna pop any day now. You're uncomfortable because it's smelly in here? Well, you could fix that. His homework's complete. Good job, John. He's ready to go for school tomorrow. Aria, how are you doing? I want you guys to both be teens as soon as possible. Oh, there's a bathroom toilet that is broken. Oh, and now the shower is also broken. Incredible. I think I'm gonna delete this toilet and do the unbreakable one. Flip the unbreakable toilet. Okay, boom. Never have to worry about that toilet breaking again. Aria's doing her homework over here at the poolside. That's pretty cute. They're hanging out in the pool at uh, 2 a.m. Aria's learning by staring at her hand. Come on, 100%. Yeah, let's go to bed. You did good work. You did good work, my darling. You know what? No, I don't want. Actually, maybe she should hire emergency repair service and see if a man shows up. Oh, she just walked in on her daughter. That's okay. She's your daughter. You've seen her nude. Oh, okay, apparently that's not okay. She's watching her toddler. I don't know where she's watching her toddler from. Chelsea, hire that emergency repair service. I wanna see that happen. Be like, repair man. Can you please send specifically a person that can impregnate a woman? No reason. <laughs> All right, we'll arrive on Friday at 6.50 a.m. Amazing. Okay, well, why don't we give a bath to Sirius? I think Sirius is still pretty smelly, yeah. Oh, there's the, re oh, it's a woman. It's a repair woman, which is totally fine, but probably not someone that can impregnate Chelsea. Oh my gosh, they're all going to school. Bye, sweeties. I hope you're, uh, 
a teen soon. I bet Aria and John will definitely be teens. Oh shoot, Aria, get up, you're late for school. Go, 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 be quick. Don't miss school, don't be late. Oh my gosh, you're gonna be late, you're gonna be late. No, 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 no. Okay, she's fine, okay. Everyone's fine, oh. Frack, you're definitely late for school though. Oh man, Freya. Oh yeah, the principal's calling. Yeah, I know, I'm late for school, I'm so sorry. Of course Freya was the one to, to sleep through the alarm because she's like the wild child. Uh, why don't you flash cards? Teach spacious music. <gasps> Chelsea's in labor! She's in labor during a garden salad. And she looks sick again. Great. Okay, Veer Nair is probably gonna be there. So all we gotta do is befriend him like a lot, like a lot, a lot. Hopefully he'll be at the hospital. We just need to focus on friendship this time. Where are you, Veer? There he is. Uh, get to know, you know, like ask about handiness, share photos, just become his best friend. Take a photo together, tell a joke about ducks. Psh, ducks, they're hilarious. Uh, discuss some interests, hug. Talk about the rain again. He's a kleptomaniac. Great, so is my daughter Brielle. Uh, ask about his day. I always love when people ask about my day. I think that's very, like a nice thing to do. I know she could have a baby right now, but I really want him to come home with her after this. Offer a massage, share photos. She's really laying it on thick. In the rain, both ill and having a baby. Like what an MVP our Chelsea is. When she's got a mission, She's gonna put it all on the line. And that's why we respect her. Okay, it's it's getting up there. It's getting up there. He's very happy. So, oh, he's also very flirty. Oh, John's an A student and so is Aria. Nova's a C student and so is Freya, but that's like to be expected a little bit. Wow, okay, so we got a lot to do when we get home. Jeez. This guy's taken a lot of work. Why is she sparkling? I'm a little confused, but I'm cool with it. I think they are so good of friends that they're gonna be good. Yeah, join. Oh, pff. she just asked the, I've like kind of like messed with the game so much that it re-asked us if we should have this baby at the hospital. They're like, hey, uh, so you've been here a while. She's very much contraction-y. Even the game is trying to wrap it up. Why is she sparkling? I don't understand why she is a sparkling girl. She's got a pristine reputation, maybe it's that. All right, let's get these babies out. Well, actually baby, there's probably only gonna be one. All right, it's a girl, a baby girl. Let's see what we should name our baby girl. As always, if you wanna submit a name for Chelsea's babies, feel free to do so in the comments. Uh, that is the only place I look. Ooh, I like this Bailey and Ryan for boys and Tegan and Haley as girls. I love the name Tegan. I love Tegan. Tegan and Peachishme. Incredible! Tegan and Peachishme, welcome to the family. Okay, you're gonna just chill there, Chels? How are you gonna kiss him? You're stuck in there. Let's debug her. Oh, okay, she, uh, that was weird. <laughs> Let's go home, Chelsea. I think you, you're a little tired from this experience. So yeah, guys, this is where I'm gonna leave it. Thank you guys so much for watching. We just hit 30 babies. It's officially 30 babies. We successfully navigated the ocean of babies. I'm proud of us. I'll see you next time.